Life Audio. Thank you for listening to Your Daily Prayer, a podcast dedicated to helping you find the words you need to connect with your Father in Heaven. No matter what is going on in your life today, you can trust God wants to hear from you. Right after this short word from our sponsor, we'll pray through today's prayer on our family safety together. A Prayer to Trust God with Your Family's Safety, written and read by Jessica Van Roekel. Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God, in whom I trust. Psalm 91, 1 and 2. When my children were small, we loved making forts out of blankets draped over chairs. They would gather their pillows and books to make a cozy nest inside, and it became the best kind of place to be when they needed some time to relax. Their time with their forts reminded me of my own at my grandparents' where I played, hid, or rested. Our verse today tells us about a shelter. This kind of shelter is for people of all ages who know God as their God. It offers security to those who commit themselves to God's plans and protection and who live with a constant awareness of God's presence. It can be tempting to relegate our time with God as a task on our to-do list, but God is with us through all parts of our lives if we can remember to remember Him. The world we live in can seem so threatening. Drivers text while driving, motorists fail to have insurance, bullies can be found in schools, jobs, homes, or churches. Health scares come out of nowhere. The gospel gets diluted with the flavors of humanism or religious requirements. It can compel us to keep our families close, to micromanage their comings and goings, or to remain in constant contact, which can lead to worry and anxiety. Peace can seem elusive, but it can grow the more time we spend communicating with Christ, learning from His Word, and serving His purposes. We can learn to experience this peace during times of worry and anxiousness about our family's safety by living in the shadow of God's protection, comfort, and care. He longs to hide us in the shadow of who He is and to gather us to Him if we are willing. We can get to know God better by understanding His four names in these verses from Psalm chapter 91. The Most High God means He is greater than any threat we face. He is bigger than any fear we have about our family. Genesis chapter 14 verse 19 tells us He created the heavens and the earth. When worry grips our heart, We can look up and notice the land and sky around us, and we can see a visual reminder of God's greatness. The second name referred to is Almighty. This name emphasizes God's power. This is the name Abraham, Moses, Moses, and Isaac knew him by. Moses witnessed God's power when he led the Israelites to freedom. Abraham saw God keep his promise to a couple who were past childbearing age, and Isaac beheld the power of God to provide a sacrifice. Lord assures us that he is the leader and authority in those who choose to follow him. His presence and guidance are always with us. This is why we can say with confidence that he is our refuge and fortress. Knowing God is Lord is like coming in from a storm. The storm still rages outside, but we are safe inside. Worry can be like a storm swirling around us, but when we choose to make the Lord our refuge, we can find relief. The last name mentioned in this verse is God. This name expresses the truth 
that God has chosen to have a deep, personal relationship with those who trust in Him. It is through our intimate knowledge with God where we receive the benefits of protection, comfort, and care. We cannot always protect our family, but we can trust the One who is the Creator of heaven and earth, the Almighty One who is more powerful than our greatest worry, the Lord who is always with us to guide and our God who loves us intimately and who is worthy of our dependence. Let's pray. Holy God, thank you for being with me when the worry and anxiety is great. Psalm 94, 19 says, When anxiety was great within me, your consolation brought me joy. Help me lean into this truth. There is so much to worry about regarding my family. Will they be safe on the road? Will they be targeted by online predators? Will they live for you or choose to turn away? The worries can debilitate me and I feel crushed by the weight of them. But you are the Most High God, creator of this world, creator of my family and me. You are Almighty God, able to overcome my greatest fears. You are my Lord ever-present in my life to lead and to guide, and you are my God, involved in every detail of my life, caring about the things that concern me. I choose to trust you. I trust you with my family's safety. You are mighty to save and catch me when I fall. You are great and worthy of praise in the good times and the bad times. You are are my rock and refuge. Help me to trust you with my family's safety. You love my family more than I can imagine, and you have good plans for their lives too. Keep my family close to your heart and guide their steps as you guide mine. In Jesus' name, amen. Your Daily Prayer is a production of Life Audio and Salem Media. If you liked what you heard today, please take a second to rate and review this podcast in your favorite podcast app so that more listeners like you can find the show. For more faith-filled, inspirational podcasts, visit us at lifeaudio.com.